Hello everyone, Lela's here and my darling cute stitch for today is going to be single crochet stitch. Now single crochet stitch is pretty much look-alike of slip stitch. Um, but let me tell you, those are not the same. Okay, here is slip stitch. See, I pulled out yarn through the crochet chain. This is my working yarn and now I'm going to pull out this yarn through the stitch I had on my hook. Now, um, once more, this is slip stitch. Okay, now single crochet stitch is the same process oops, sorry, it's the same process. We pull out yarn through the crochet chain or any other you know background fabric that we are crocheting and then we take our working yarn pull over the crochet and pull out through those both stitches okay now I'll do this again Um, little detail here when you try to pull out your working yarn through the crochet chain always try to catch those two yarns because it adds the stability to the fabric see if you would like to pull out only one yarn just for, for the information, you may want to do that uh, because it has, you know, the tendency to stretch and it may make your little hole here like like this. See, the, over time it may stretch and make you the hole. So you have to think what you would like um, to do ahead so you know what how to pull out your working gear, okay? So at this point I would love to pull out my working yarn through the two of those stitches. See, this is my beautiful darling little single crochet. This is back and this is front. Notice that um, in the periodical single crochet is drawn as a little crest. Okay, and the equal sign when we turn, I, I will explain this, um, when we turn from one row to another is one chain stitch. So single crochet equals to one chain stitch. Okay, everyone, experiment with your single crochet. Um, happy knitting and thanks for listening.